Hey guys, and welcome back to my vlog on quitting smoking. Um, everything's pretty okay. I I don't know what it is with me because I actually talked to my one of my doctors, and the thing is, is like I think my personality. I'm not like sure with other people's personality, but with my personality, um, I don't really have like this addictive state and I told this to my doctor Dr. G my therapist um yeah I don't really have like an addictive personality either with substances or with people like I'm so I mean it's kind of bad in a sense but I'm pretty good at like just cutting people off or cutting things off because it's like not as important if there's drama involved you know like I'm one of those people that don't like drama I like it to be calm and chill and no craziness you know so yeah so i mean it's been like what three weeks now of quitting smoking um i've been pretty good with it uh especially in situations where you really want to smoke like when you're at the bar and you're like drinking and other people around you are smoking like it kind of makes you want to smoke but for me not really. I think for me, I think I've said this before, but I wanted to smoke mainly in the sense of like stepping outside or something. So now what I do is like, oh, I'm just going to go outside for a little quick. And I just grab my phone and just like look at my phone when I go outside or step outside for like a little piece, piece for a little bit of me time when I'm out and about. Um, yeah, so that's what I normally done now. Um, I did want to say like, I, I have still like smoked cannabis um, so that's like I don't know if that's cheating in a sense with my estrogens pills um, I'm gonna talk to my doctor about it whether it's fine is it like and I said this in my other video whether I it's is it the, the nicotine that's bad for me to smoke that's causing the blood clots or is it like the concept of smoke going through your lungs like what is it because then like i also want to like do cannabis but then i can do edibles anyways because it's legal here in the cinema but um like edibles is fine it's just the thing with me is like i've had good experiences and really really bad experiences with cannabis like cannabis for me like oh my gosh you guys like with edibles i remember i went to this one <laughs> i went to this one birthday right my friend gretchen jen i went to this birthday dinner we were at um, Casa Ushima and someone brought brownies and like you it would never go to your head like thinking that it's that you are that there's something in the brownie but um I ate like a very small wine like a small little cannabis and um, edible and then I went I left that place I ate that one I'm like oh it's so good is there more and she's like no girl everyone got one piece I'm like okay why you bought like one like for one person it's so little so i was like whatever so then i go like it was early too like we finished like around what, do you, what time did we finish i think we finished like around um 8 30 or something so it's like super early so i was like oh i'm gonna go to johnny's bar so i go to johnny's bar i park right in front of godfather's right godfather's and i walk to johnny's bar and i go there and then i meet up with a friend like some random person and we're just talking and then i'm just like Whoa. <laughs> what the hell is going on right now like why am I seeing two of you why can't I like be normal or like act normal <laughs> anyways long story short I was in my car in front of Godfather's which is next to me is safe house another bar and it's a street a public street I needed to vomit because I don't know what the hell was going on with me um, I couldn't because the bars are there people walking all over the place I wish I parked somewhere private but I couldn't even like pick up my arm I was like a vegetable basically I was like legit veggie like I could not move it's insane so I literally couldn't drive obviously I would have like just crashed right there um so <laughs> like leaving the parking spot boop, crash um so I had a friend pick me up which was pretty smart so like he parked like right next to my car like I was right here and I basically like just jumped into his car because I couldn't even walk it was insane like I was sweating it was it was just the weirdest situation in the world so that was like my worst experience with edibles um 
I've had a couple okay sessions with, with edibles at other times, but I mean, if I can't smoke, I guess I'll do that. And I love cooking. So I think that's one of the things I'm gonna start like getting into as well is like cooking with edibles, um, with butter, cannabis, um, if I can't smoke it. Because the reason why I'm quitting smoking, I mean, obviously it's great for your health, you know, like just the idea of like not smoking. But um, there's a reason for me to not smoke because of my transition of, with the hormones, with blood clots, you know, I'm okay with it. So I'm pretty good with it. But then like with cannabis, I can pick that out too. It's not that important to me. But just the idea of like whether it's okay or not, that's what I just want to know. So if I need to quit it or not, just something to get myself into that conversation with my doctor. That's what I want to know. So. Yeah, I mean, it's pretty good. Not very addictive person. So I'm pretty good with like, not like, oh my God, I need to smoke or eat or like, or anything. All right, so thank you guys for joining me. Just like so many kids here. Um, I'll see you guys later. Um, thank you for joining me here at my quitting smoking vlog. <laughs> my third, I guess, or fourth, something like that. Um, continue to join me. Don't forget to subscribe down below. Hit the smash like button and ring the bell for notification for my new videos. It's once a week I do these videos. Um, you'll be notified when it's going to be uploaded. Um, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.